What's going on everyone? Welcome back to a brand new video. Welcome back to the Shark Sunday Survival! Wait, it's not Sunday? Wow, well that's, that's, that's a little awkward. It's not even Sunday and it's called the Shark Sunday Survival. What? You guys seem to really like the name Shark Sunday Survival and I should probably upload it on Sundays, but you know, Let's not upload it on Sundays and let's just call it the Shark Sunday Survival. <laughs> What's going on, everyone? I hope everyone's having a really good day so far. Whoa, 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 whoa. Yes. I know what you're thinking. So a couple days ago on the channel, I didn't actually make like a legitimate video trying to express this. So for a couple months now, I've been wanting to change my YouTube channel name or furthermore call it as a rebrand that people will call it you know technical terms and you know i wanted to change the name from zero nine shark boy to something else i mean this year is actually my 10 year anniversary on youtube if you go to the about page you'll notice that my youtube channel was created on august 16th 2009 so this will be my 10 year anniversary on youtube and yeah, I didn't exactly wait for August 16th, but I felt it was time and I felt like uh, now was the best time to do it. So guys, you might have noticed I changed my YouTube channel name. It's just Shark now. On the first day it happened and the video went out, I saw you guys all trying to comment like, Oh, you changed your name! And I didn't really make a formal like, hey, this is what's going on, but I figured we could do that here. Nothing is changing on the channel. I just want to be known as shark you know for 10 years i've been known as zero nine shark boy and every time i read the comments everybody refers me as to just shark so i feel like it's a lot easier for people to not only know kind of who i am but for me also to you know it's like hey i'm just shark i'm not I'm not zero nine shark boy you know I'm, I'm just shark i feel like it fits guys and I, i'm really excited to see where we can go in the future of the channel Maybe we can make the name Shark into something really big one day, which is, at the end of the day, that's one of my biggest goals. But, I mean, yeah, that's that's why I did it, guys. I'm not leaving YouTube. Minecraft's not ending. Don't worry. <laughs> All right, seriously, no more messing around. We got some survival to get to. So, ladies and gentlemen, we are back in the world. Hey, Philip, how did you get out? You got to get back in the birdcage. Hey, what are you doing between the doors over here? Get, get, get in here. Uh, we gotta round up these birds before they start going crazy. <laughs> Wait, what is this? It seems to me, what is this? Is there a leash or something? Oh! Oh, hi! I think we've got some visitors, guys. I, where did these guys come from? What? Oh, hello. How's it going, villager? Wait, who? Is this, a, is this a trader? Okay, well, we have two llamas. Wait, are these mine? Okay, so one emerald is a slime ball. Wait, can I, can I keep you guys? Hey, do you want to... Oh, no. Did I not close the front door? Oh, my gosh. That's such a bad habit. I got to get into doing... <laughs> no, this is so bad. Okay, so you want to trade with me. Emeralds for slime. I don't really have any slime, but I can allow you into my house. I'm so glad we finished off the animal farm because now we're... I mean, we can openly invite some more people here. Hey, you guys want to come in? Yeah, feel free. Come on in. We got room. We got, we got space. Everything you'd ever want. It's all over here. Yep, come on inside. There we go. Everybody inside. It's a happy family in here. You know, we got lots of room. I No, wrong way. You know, I don't really know if I'm supposed to keep the... <laughs> if I'm supposed to do this. Hey, where are you going? Hey, where are you going? Come here, man. Go inside the house. I need to somehow get this guy inside of the house. I just want him to go inside with all of the llamas. So then we can have a, you know, a family of llamas. Okay, inside. Inside. You got to bring the llamas in here too. Llamas inside. Yeah, there we go. We got it. Okay, this is kind of... Nope, 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 nope. <laughs> Flip! And do I need to open up the door? Is it too small? Can the llamas not fit through this? That could be why. Trader, you know, I am awfully bored in this house. So having some friends here would be something that I would greatly appreciate. You know, man, we can really get some good trades going here. I can give you as many emeralds as I find, which as of right now are zero. But, you know, eventually I know I will find emeralds. So I will have a lot to trade with you. Just you need to trust me and live with me, please. I need a roommate. I'm desperate for a roommate and I don't want to be alone. Come on now. If we can get the llamas in here too. Wait, now what if I what if I do this? I mean, this can kind of work, right? So I can just hold them inside the house for a minute now. Now is all I need to do is get the llamas inside. Llama, inside the house. It is safer this way. Yes, llama. Good boy. Okay, we are missing a second llama. <laughs> Poor guy stuck in the glass. Do I even have any more glass or is he going to just live there forever? Come here, little guy. 
You gotta come this way. No, oh, you're stuck. Okay, we're gonna have to do some surgery on the house then. I have glass to use, so I mean, I guess I can break it. Okay, okay, llama, can you just like not freak out, please? We are going to carefully and ever so slightly break all of this. Okay, llama, you gotta get in the house now. Hey, Philip, you gotta move too. Do I have to break this too? Maybe this is not enough. He can't get through this. We can block off this entrance now. All right, little guy. Okay, it is almost nighttime here, man. You need to get inside of this house. <laughs> Yes, get inside. Go. Get inside. Oh, my gosh. Yes, we got him inside. It actually worked. Okay, thank you. There we go. Oh, my goodness. We now need to get the birds inside. So, you need to sit. And now, Philip, get. Get. Get inside. Philip, get. Get over here, Philip. You got to get inside. It's getting late out, okay? I guess I should really open this up if I'm going to have some big animals coming through. Now, let's just go ahead and close this off. There we go. Beautiful. Oh, I forgot about the front door. Yeah, I might want to do this one just so nobody can get back inside. <laughs> Beautiful. We finally got the in. Wait, okay. I'll let you guys out too. I, don't worry. I, I really don't want to leave you here. Oh, what? Hello? Is he invisible right now? Did he drink an invisibility potion? I think he totally did. He did. I have a ghost in my house. There is a ghost villager here, guys. I don't know if I like this. This is kind of creepy. Not going to lie. Whew. All right. I just started that off at the start of the episode. It kind of took too long. I don't. I, I didn't mean it for, for it to take that. Oh, hey, little guy. Thanks for coming in. So as you guys are aware, on this series on the channel, we'd like to pull ideas and comments from you guys, the viewers, and try and incorporate them in this series. Ooh, we need to see what we have now to do. So this is the previous video. And again, I just want to say thank you guys for the support you guys have been showing. 12,000 likes. I mean, I did not like... It, you know, obviously, like, the first video, it got, like, 20,000 likes. So, I imagine some people that may not have wanted to continue watching this series probably didn't even bother to watch episode two. But for those, like, you guys that actually are watching this series and wanting to see more of this, thank you. I wanted, I really wanted to make a cool series that other people would enjoy. And, you know, I know I can't please everyone, but at least if you guys are enjoying it, then, you know, that makes me really happy. Let's see what we got to do. I did see one which I thought was really, really cool, and it was from GamerGirl2008. They said, challenge ideas... Make a bird pen in the underground base and make a lava protection around the house. Another challenge was by No Signal. They said, name the Series Shark Sur Survival Sundays and challenge, get a fishing rod and go fishing. Oh, wait, you guys, oh, you guys decided to move? Okay, great. Now we can, we have a perfect home. Wait, hold up. I just need to fix this. There we go. Perfect. Yay. Oh, this looks so uneven, but it's, it's okay for now. It's okay. So both the ideas that I mentioned are great ideas and there's something that I would love to get to. If I could make a sign, that would be great. All right, here we go. The next challenge is so in the previous episode, we've already built a water slide to the cave. We made the cave walkway. We finished the roof and we built or we started building our underground base. In this episode by GamerGirl2008, they said make a lava protection around the home. Great idea. I thought that was really cool. And I actually had a really unique way that we could try and pull this off. It will take time, but I did think of a unique way. Oh my gosh. If we ever try and get animals inside of this house ever again, it is going to be one of the hardest things to do now that they, the whole house is going to be covered in lava. All right, Philip, you can stay out there if you really want to, man. I mean, I don't know what you're doing. And one of the other challenges was from No Signal. And they said, uh, make a fishing rod and go fishing. I overall think that's a great idea because I don't have any food. I mean, my my hunger here is like, it's not doing well. I really got to start getting a food supply if I want to survive in this place for any more, any longer time. I'm thinking the lava base is something we could probably get to. I don't know if we're going to be able to complete the entire lava base, but there is a way I thought about pulling this off. But you know what? Now that I think about it, I need to make a bed, okay? I just... I don't have any wool, don't I? Let me guess. I don't have any wool in the chest down here either. That's why haven't I why haven't I bothered getting wool yet? I don't have any wool, so it doesn't look like I'm going to sleep. Oh boy. Okay. Wait, where did he go? Oh, I'm sorry. I did not mean to hit you. I did ow, okay. Ow! Alright, I'm sorry! Guys, I did not mean to hit you. Okay? Wait, do they hate me now? Do they like not want to be friends? Oh gosh. This is bad. Oh, no. Hey, Llama, chill, bro. Look, all right, maybe if I give him space for a bit, he'll, like, just leave me alone. But, like, I don't know what in the world I just did there. I did not mean to hit him at all like that. Like, what in the world was that sound? I don't like that. 
Really? You want me to put this to the test and take the water slide and go find out exactly what that sound was? If I don't make it back, I know I'm totally dead. Oh, lovely. There's a skeleton right here. What's up? What's up, skeleton? How's it going? Did you make that creepy sound? Are you trying to scare me? You're not going to scare me in this mine, skeleton. I don't really get scared. Ow! Okay, maybe that's a lie. I was, you know, just let me kill this skeleton already. Oh, okay, there's more. <laughs> no, this is not good. I just want to go and get some sheep. Wait, there's no sheep in a mine. What am I doing? Ow! Oh, they're in here. Okay, yeah, bad idea. There we go. Thank you. All right, we got them both. Great. Now I'm not fully dead. Look, I don't know what's going on down here with all these creepy sounds and whatnot. But I want to get to the bottom of this to try and figure out. Oh, no. Listen, spider. Cave spider. It's a cave spider. It's a cave spider. All right. Now I'm almost dead. Awesome. Just the best thing ever. Great. Okay. Going to close that up. Yep. Awesome. I got a bow. No way. All right. Now I really can't be dying. Let's just block this off because we're smart. Oh, hi, spider. Yeah, let's just, you know, let's forget I'm down here. I need more torches if I'm going any deeper in this mine. All right, spider. Look, I don't want to do, I don't want anything to do with you. But as long as you don't want anything to do with me, man, I mean, we're on good terms here. I was hoping I could kind of check out uh, some other parts of this cave. I thought it was so cool down here. And I know we didn't get to explore everything. I just want to find my first diamond. That's like the biggest thing I just want to do. I just want to find my first diamond and be good to go. Now, there's a minecart and a chest here. Did I get anything? Oh, my gosh. Yo, let's go. That is so cool. I got a golden apple. All right, whatever happens today, I cannot die in this mine. I have way too much loot to offer. And gonna be completely honest with you, I really don't want to die in this mine. Oh my goodness. This is just ridiculous. Does it go anywhere else? It just seems to be going in just like the same patterns. Oh my, dude, I'm totally gonna get lost. We have not found any diamonds yet. We've found pretty much every single ore except for emeralds and redstone, I think. No diamonds as of yet. Kind of disappointed, but well, I mean, we'll keep, we can keep looking. Lots of water. Is that gold over there? Yeah, that's gold. Man, I kind of, I feel like I lucked out. Hopefully when I get back up to the, to the house, it'll be daytime. I just want to get a bed. I am sick and tired of dying by every single mob when I go out at nighttime. I need to make a bed so I can go to sleep. It's just the worst. Playing Minecraft without a bed is probably one of the worst ways to go about it. What was that snap noise when I like actually came down here? Like that was actually creepy. I hope I didn't lose my way home either. That would be really bad. Oh, I might as well get string while I'm down here. I need a sword for it, don't I? I need to totally have a sword. And do I have any swords? Nope. No, I don't. Might as well. Oh, I had a crafting table. I already crafted one too. Flip. Okay, well, I'm going to just go ahead and do it. Yeah, let's just get all of this while we can now because we'll be able to make a fishing rod. I like the idea that we'll be able to actually be able to fish from home, which I thought was originally the coolest idea. We can make a little fishing room in the house. I think that would be really cool. Oh my gosh, what is this? Okay, I need to find my way back up. Skeleton, what's going on? I hear an enderman too. All right, there we go. Thank you very much. All right, back up to the house. We're good. I heard a creeper. Nah, I'm all right. I'm okay. I'm just going to go back up this way. No, thank you, creeper. <laughs> Whew. We got some string now that we can start fishing, so that'll be good. We can actually start eating at this house. And it seems to be daytime. Yes, it is daytime. Thank you. Let's make another chest down. Actually, no, we'll just place this one. I'm throwing all of our rare loot inside of here. Because now I want to go get ourselves some sheep and hopefully some food. All right, kids. You guys be good. You be good. I love you. We need names for these guys. Let me know some cool names down below in the comments, guys. Because I would like to name the trader. And I would like to name both of the beautiful llamas we have. You guys be safe and be good. I will be back very soon. And we can hopefully establish a good trade. All right. Where's my first bird? I can, Philip can come with me, but I don't want any other bird to come. All right, birds, you guys want to come on an adventure? Good, Philip. Come on, little guy, let's go. We need to find some sheep. Now, this could be a very difficult task, seeing as we're in a jungle. There's not a lot of animals that are, you know, relatively sheep-like out in this jungle. I mean, unless we happen to get lucky. Oh, I completely forgot for the lava over the house. This will be perfect because we literally have a lava pool right there so we can easily get access to it you know let's try going the other way we've always kind of gone backwards on the house let's try going this way maybe we can get lucky and find some sheep this way definitely have some fish underwater i need okay thank you i need you and i need you i am such a horrible person and i need you thank you very much i am very hungry fish come back right like they just like respawn or is 
Am I just killing everybody near here? Is that a pumpkin I see? Is that a pumpkin? If so, that means that we'll be able to get a... Wait, if that's a pumpkin, I can get a jack-o'-lantern. No, what am I saying? If that's a pumpkin, we got enough iron to make an iron golem. We might actually, hopefully. Oh my gosh, it is. No way. We can have an iron golem too. Let's go. We are definitely taking that. That is going to be a very cool prize for eventually when we get a golem. The mighty golem can protect our house and protect our beautiful birds as well. Oh, wait. Shh. 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 I swear I heard a sheep. I swear I heard a sheep go, meh. Whatever noise they make. If you did, can you do it again? Sheep, make this easy on both. I can't tell if that was the parrot. I think that was both the parrots that were making that noise and it wasn't the sheep. Oh, man. I got excited for a sec. I thought we actually found ourselves a sheep. There ought to be something out here. Some actually, you know what? We've got to be getting out of this jungle at some point here. This is so crazy. You know, maybe we'll come across an ocelot as well, and uh, we can maybe tame them with the raw fish that we have. If I don't find something soon, I'm going to turn around. We've been running for so long here, and we literally can't find anything. I think what I need to start doing is I'm going to have to label parts of the jungle, especially if we're going to start doing some crazy traveling. I keep hearing all these creepy noises, man. What is this? I don't know. Minecraft is supposed to be a horror game. I don't know if I like this. Oh, my ravine. That is a massive drop. There's a lot of cave systems around here. We like, we could probably tunnel over to this ravine at some point. <gasps> it's an ocelot. No way. Guys, we might be able to pull this off. I have some raw fish for you. Kitten, you just need to, this, okay, look, this is going to be fair. You either love me and take the fish or I'm going to eat it. Nope, nope, nope. You just wasted my food. That was all of my food that I was going to eat. Oh my gosh. Oh, hi. Hey, little guy. You are so cute. Can you come home with me? Yes, he loves me. Oh my gosh. All right, Ocelot. Oh, it's a mama Ocelot. That is the cutest thing I have ever seen. I'm I'm actually so sad. I'm actually kind of tearing up. That is the cutest thing. There are baby Ocelots over here. Oh, you guys are so adorable. If I go kill more fish, will you love me, please? Hi, Piggy Piggy. I need you. I got to eat you. Okay, I had a I had an Ocelot take the remaining of my food, so I need you, please. <laughs> Thank you. I'm so hungry. Thank you very much. Are there any sheep out this way, maybe? In, it's somewhere in the jungle. Like, I just need two. Two sheeps. Now, if I'm not mistaken, our home should be right over here. Yes, we are correct. Okay. Lots of fish here. There's a possibility I could pro maybe get that ocelot or one of them. I just don't want him eating all of our food supply. <laughs> oh, gosh. Is it worth going for that ocelot right now? It's almost nighttime. It's almost nighttime. Is it worth it? Is it worth it? It's worth it. It's so worth it. Oh, no. We can't find him. No. It's nighttime again, too. Come on. <gasps> Hi. Hey, little guy. Come here. No, no, no. No, no. <gasps> yes. No way he loves me. All right. Get in the house. I got three hearts. Uh, hello? What was that noise? Please don't kill me. I'm so close to dying. I am so close to dying. <gasps> Hi, guys. How are you? It's so good to see you. I just came back from my adventure, and I am so happy to let you guys know that we have a new pet. Where is he? Hello? I don't know where any of the birds went or the ocelot, but, you know, they'll come around, right? Right? Now that I have all this string, uh, which should be a ocelot. Oh, my gosh. Are you freaking kidding me? We have phantoms here. What have I done to deserve phantoms, dude? I am, I am in no shape to fight a phantom. Oh, boy. Oh, no. Come on. Where in the world did all of that string go? I literally went down in the mine so I could make a fishing rod after. Did I, did I like, not pick it up or something? Oh, my gosh. Look at that phantom. Hey. I don't think you want to be in my little mob farm. I don't think that's how this works. We can go ahead and start doing this now because uh, I feel a lot more safe knowing that we have another friend here. We need more iron. Do we have any more iron? Please tell me we have more iron somewhere. I'm going to build it out. So this is the golem so far. We literally need one more block and we'll be okay. One more piece of iron. That is wow. And I literally am only missing one piece of iron. Oh, uh, flip. There was a creeper down here last, wasn't there? There totally was a creeper down here. Look, if we can work this out and just you let me go and get what I need. All right, creeper. Go, go, go. Oh my gosh, he's not here. Okay, perfect. This is the iron we need for the golem. And I'll be good to go. I'll be happy. I'll take a little bit extra, maybe, because I'm greedy. It's okay, though. I just need to finish off my set. We'll get some coal, because seeing as we're right here, we're good. We got a golem. Let's go. 
All right, now we should be able to head back up and everything will be okay. I'm just thinking, guys, with that golem, we'll have another friend. We'll have another friend. Not only will we have another animal, but somebody to actually protect me around here because I cannot protect myself. Oh my gosh, this is probably the happiest day of my life. Hey, I don't know why this guy keeps going invisible too. I don't know if he, like I offended him for something, but he like does not want to look at me anymore. He just doesn't like me at all. All right, we have enough iron. Let's just, let's finish this off here. Welcome the one and only beautiful iron golem. Wait a second. Apparently you can use shears and make it into uh, a jack-o'-lantern. I don't know if that's true. Yes, let's go. What's up, little guy here? Welcome to my world here. <gasps> what did you just give me? You just give me iron? Here you go. You want that? There you go, man. It's all yours. Wait, didn't they pick up the roses? I thought they picked them up. I thought they loved to hold these. I don't know if that, that used to be a thing in old Minecraft or not, but here, here you go. Ladies and gentlemen, we are making some crazy progress on the survival world, as you guys can tell. The next episode, I wanted to go ahead and uh, finish the... I wanted to finish the underground base along with do the protection around the house. Um, I feel like that would be really, really cool. I have a pretty cool concept as to how I want to do the lava protection so it doesn't mess up all the water around us either. So I, I'm really excited to see how that all goes down. But ladies and gentlemen, I just want to say thank you guys all so much for showing all the support that you guys have further shown on this series. Iron Golem, what are you doing? If you guys are enjoying today's series and you guys want to see some more of it, make sure you guys drop some comments down below of some ideas that I can do in this series. I'll be picking a bunch of you guys in the next episode. It probably won't be on Sunday. It'll be a let random day this week. So you got to turn on the bell notification so you'll know if you got a shout out in the video. But ladies and gents, that's going to be it for me today. I hope you guys all have a safe and fantastic rest of your day. And I'll catch you guys tomorrow in a brand new video. Take care. Hey guys, did you enjoy today's video? If you did and you want to see some more from me, you see the video and playlist over there. All you guys got to do is click or tap and you'll be sent to the next video. Until then, I'll see you there.